November 14th, 1969. Apollo 12 sits on the launch pad, ready to boldly go where one man had gone before. But with a twist, it's not Klingons or Romulans they're about to encounter, but a foe more shocking, lightning. Just 36 seconds after liftoff, Mother Nature decides to join the space race. Apollo 12 gets struck by lightning, not once, but twice. Because why settle for a single jolt when you can have a double feature? Back at mission control, it's a sea of confused faces. Monitors go haywire, data disappears faster than my motivation on a Monday. The spacecraft's fuel cells are offline and the guidance system is kaput. But fear not, for Alan Bean, the mission's lunar module pilot, has an ace up his sleeve. He remembers an obscure switch from training. The SCE to AUX. Sounds like a tech support solution, right? Have you tried turning it off and on again? Bean flips the switch and voila, powers back. Apollo 12, not to be outdone by a little static, goes on to have one of the most successful moon missions, proving that a little shock therapy can't keep a good rocket down. The Apollo 12 lightning strike, a tale of resilience, quick thinking, and how to keep cool when you're literally a human lightning rod. Remember, in space no one can hear you scream, but they can definitely hear you zap.